Hello, today we are going to be demonstrating how to split an order. I am already logged on as a buyer to my RepSpark account and I am shopping on a specific brand. So I'm going to go ahead and click products and start shopping. So I'm clicking the orange button of click to start order. I do have a required field. All of my information is pre-populated and I'm going to add in my PO, which is required. So PO123, and I'm going to save. So I'm going to start filling my cart with a few items that I would like using the small feature here and then going ahead and filling in quantity once I get in the cart. So I have added these three items, maybe four. And so now I'm gonna take a look in my cart and review what I have entered and go ahead and add my quantity. So as you see, some of these items are not in stock. They are not available at once, but do have future ship dates. So I'm going to still enter my desired size run of everything I need, including the out of stock items. So as you see, when I go in and I these items are read, there is still action required. So when I click on that, it lets me know that I can have a few options. The first option is to push the entire order when all items are available to split, to ship. So this would not be splitting the order. This would have all items ship and be completed. The order would be completed on 10-27-23. But my other two options are splitting the order. I can split by size. This will remove each unit by size that is not currently available and split out to a new order with the next available date. There could be multiple splits leading to multiple orders. And the other option is to split by line. So this is splitting by product. So this would remove similar to the size, but all units for the entire style that is not currently available and will split out to new orders with the next available date. There could also be multiple splits leading to multiple orders. So for today, I'm going to choose this option and I'm going to be choosing the option of split and submit all orders. You can also split and only submit the first order, but for today, I'm going to split split this into a, multiple orders. So I'm going to click the arrow, and then you see that I, my now my order is split from 10-4 and 10-27. So this item will ship immediately, and this item will be pushed back to 10, or these items will be pushed back to 10-27. In this box, I could also change my mind and split by size, but for today's example, I'm going to go back to line. So now I am going to continue to check out. I'm going to look at my review. I have my first item down here, and then I have my three additional items. And you see, I am getting a message that says, your order has been split into orders 6734 and 6735. So I'm going to check out, process my order, and my order has successfully been split into two different orders.